You're going to have a bath time. <laughs> Much better. Welcome to Undertale Comic TV. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. That way you'll never miss a video. Enjoy! Here you go, my child. Idiot! You'll be as fat as that old hag if you keep eating that garbage. Stupid kid. Stupid cliché domestic scenarios. Stupid pot! Okay, okay. So maybe it's not that stupid. I'm fine. You don't even know how to treat someone. Yes, I know. I have magical kisses. Once, near when we first met, I sat him down and kind of forced him to draw something. I gave him some paper and a box of crayons. His response was to look at me dead in the sockets, take a white crayon, and draw a line across the page. Huh? He then proceeded to hand me back the paper, all while maintaining eye contact. It was hilarious. <laughs> So, if the void is the place where nothing exists... Does that mean the anti-void is the place where everything exists at once? Hmm... The f*** are you doing here?! Oh, I'm in a killer of a mood. Meaning I want to kill someone! Yep, I'm as big as it gets. No emotions of my own. <sighs> Maybe so. Huh? But aren't you the one choosing which emotions to act on? Hmm. Thank you, Error. Psh! Yeah, don't mention it. Ink? Hmm? What is this? A sketchbook? And why, pray tell, do you have a sketchbook filled with porn of me? One, it's technically erotica, not porn. And two, there's actually more than one. <laughs> <laughs> I need someone to be my friend. Someone who... won't run away. Maybe send me an angel! The nicest angel you have. <laughs> I need someone to be my friend. Someone who... won't run away. <laughs> hey, uh, error? What gives? Error? Uh, uh. Huh? That's what you tied me up for? You do know, you could have just asked and I would have stayed still for you. Yeah, you're right. I wouldn't believe me either. <laughs> we have arrived! Tra -la 
It is best to not listen to the static for too long. Eh, gotcha. Beware of the man who came from the other world. A man from the other world? Hmm, did that have any meaning to you, Sardens? No, not really. Your rapid change in expression tells me otherwise, brother. It just sounded like I should know, I guess. The river person once warned me of a man who speaks in hands. Perhaps he was warning me about that fire bartender friend of yours. Uh, Grilby? Yes, he speaks with his hands, and he feeds customers a substantial amount of greasy foods. Clearly something to be wary of. Perhaps he came from a world where health wasn't of any concern. You order milkshakes, bro. Let us press on. With ice cream and dinosaur sprinkles. On we press. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. Last night, I had a dream that you and Sun switched personalities. It was really weird. <laughs> <laughs> I could never imagine such a thing. In my dreams, Papyrus keeps making me stuff out of acorns and yo-yos. I once dreamt that we were all back underground. Everything was kind of the same. Except everyone's sort of mean, and everyone wore a lot of red, and Frisk had to teach everyone how to be nice. <laughs> Could you imagine, Frisk? Edgy sons and papyrus? <laughs> you guys have strange dreams. Yeah? Why don't you tell them what you dreamed about last night? I was driving my car, of course. Mm, that's not what you told me. The sun on my skin and the wind in my hair. Something about the echo flowers? I would rather not remember. They give me the creeps. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> are you guys okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, there you are, young prince. I was wondering when you would drop in. Yeah, talk about a growth spurt, huh? Well, here we are. After you. Yo, you said you wanted to talk to Snow King, right, Assy? You said he'd be visiting Snowden today, too! We can go look for him later if you want. Anyway, what should we do first? Ah, our old home. It brings back memories. Yep, lazy, snowy days. Building puzzles and traps. Grillbies. Human hunting. Fried snow. Did you just say fried snow? <laughs> <laughs> Looking for a fight, huh? Not a good idea to mess with my bro, kid. Karma is gonna come back to bite ya. Wow, Sardens. Yeah, sorry, bro. Well, I appreciate the effort, but I will take it from here. Uh-oh, you better run for it, Fisk! <laughs> you can run and you can probably hide, but I will still find you! Hate to be the bringer of bad news, but Tori has given you the 30-minute warning. Ah! What a shame. We haven't even set up the traps yet. Uh, sorry, guys. Better start heading back, or we'll all be in trouble. Do you think we can just ask for 15 more minutes? Mom doesn't like it when I ask that. She might say yes to science, though. She would especially say no to me. Uh, huh? <laughs> huh. Interesting. What's up, Sons? Uh, uh, maybe I wore myself out too much. You mean it's not working? Maybe there's a glitch with this shortcut. <laughs> 